And now your WZDX Pinpoint Weather with meteorologist Emily Owen. It was another hot one out there today and some areas actually saw 90 degrees. Check it out, 90 degrees in Huntsville, Fayetteville, Pulaski. It does look like Florence was our hottest spot coming in at 93 degrees. Pinpoint Viper, we did see a few scattered showers and thunderstorms move through earlier this afternoon, but they were very isolated in nature and majority of us did see a dry day out there. Temperatures right now, we are still sitting in the 90s in some areas. 90 right now in Huntsville, 92 in Florence, 86 degrees in Coleman, and 80. I don't think that's right in Pulaski, 80 degrees, but if it is, I'm about to tear out and head uh, up that way after work just to catch some uh, <laughs> uh, much cooler air. Bit Boy Viper right now, we are clear and we are dry, and it looks like we're going to stay that way heading into the overnight. Tonight, we will see a mostly clear sky, so all in all, Gonna be pretty quiet out there. Does look like temperatures will drop down into the lower 70s for the overnight tonight. Now for tomorrow, it looks like we're gonna have another 90 degree day and unfortunately heat index values uh, will be closer to that 100 degree range. Uh, so an isolated shower or two in the afternoon obviously can't be completely ruled out. But other than that, we will see a partly cloudy sky, but it does look like showers and storms once we get the diurnal heating will start to ramp up ahead of the cold front that's actually going to turn into a stationary front the uh, sooner it gets into the Tennessee Valley by Saturday. Showers and storms going to fire out ahead of it and notice all the way uh, over into Little Rock through a Georgia area just covered in scattered showers and thunderstorms. So Saturday and Sunday look to be a more widespread day. So that's why I do have rain chances for Saturday out of 50% and Sunday out of 70%. But notice this, we're headed downstairs once we get <laughs> through Wednesday and Thursday. And it does look like towards the end of next week, things will start to become much drier. Now, if your allergies have been acting up, uh, the Saharan dust layer is uh, back and it is covering the entire state of the of Alabama. Uh, this has been why our skies have been quite hazy out there. Seven day forecast looks like this once again for tomorrow. 90 degrees for the high temperature scattered showers and thunderstorms in the afternoon. Temperatures look to stay in the 80s, but notice Monday will actually be close to 82 degrees. So that's uh, definitely a nice change there, but we will rebound back into the 90s once we get into next Thursday with mostly sunshine. Now I'm going to toss things over to Mo Carter so we can check out what's coming up in sports.